This is a short video about the branches of the external carotid artery. But first, let us familiarize ourselves with the carotid system. Here we have the common carotid artery. This is the right side, and this is the left side. This is the common carotid. The common carotid artery bifurcates to the internal and external carotid artery. This happens around the fourth cervical vertebrae. So let's have a look. So this is the internal carotid artery and this is the external carotid artery. This is the right side and this is the left side. So this is the internal carotid artery and this is the external carotid artery. So the internal carotid artery continues inside the cranium, supplying the brain, and the external carotid artery is mostly superficial and it supplies the facial structures. We have eight major branches to the external carotid artery. Let's run through them. Unfortunately, uh, they're not all present in this model, but that's not really important for us. So let's start off with the first branch, which is the superior thyroid. This is this superior thyroid artery. Then we have the ascending pharyngeal, which is located around somewhere over here. Okay. So this is the right side. So this is superior thyroid and ascending pharyngeal. Then we have the lingual artery, which supplies the tongue, which is supposed to be somewhere over here. It's not seen in this model. Then we have the facial artery, which is quite superficial. It starts at the angle here and you can see it clearly. It has a very um, unique path. Then we have the occipital artery which is located around here. Then we have the posterior auricular artery which is this little one. Whoops. This little one over here. Then we have the maxillary artery, which we have a separate video of, which is located right over here. Then we have the superior, uh, sorry, superficial temporal, which is located right over here. Okay, next we have uh, to learn the mnemonic for the external carotid artery branches. So a very nice mnemonic I'd like to use for the external carotid artery is some anatomists like freaking out poor medical students. So if we take the first letter of each and every word, we can form a branch. So S forms the superior thyroid, A forms the ascending pharyngeal, L forms the lingual, F forms the facial, O forms the occipital, P forms the posterior auricular, M forms the maxillary, and S forms the superficial temporal artery.